Welcome back to Blood Mirror 1. It's Samuel Gordon. Okay. Now remember what we found out to go uh, to the graveyard. Find where this guy was buried. Chap on the thing. This might be it. An unmarked grave. An un. The Gordon coat of arms. That's likely the grave I'm looking for. I need go. to remove the shrub first. A thorny sh There's our coat of arms on the stone tablet. That must be the grave I'm looking for. Just gotta get the dried shrubs gone. Uh, Remove the first, though. Not sure how we're supposed to do that, though. I don't have any cutting instruments anymore. I suppose there's more glass in here to pick up. More glass to pick up. I guess we're done with this here. See anything else, but I don't. Wait a minute. Box. What's in the box? A pair of gardening scissors. Oh, well that'll help. I hadn't noticed it before. Yeah. Convenient, isn't it? Damn, it's broken. Oh. Really? They're useless like this. Hmm. How am I gonna get him to? I don't understand. How am I supposed to? Well, I found the gardening scissors. Now, what am I supposed to do with them? Here rests Sir Nathan Hawke, who left this world in the year of the Lord, 1638. Let him find his peace in the new world. Okay. Gabriel Swen, deceased in the year 1805. Oh, I see. Now let's look at these graves. They wouldn't last Damien before. Gale, our dear and beloved son. Left us forever in 1814. Now these graves are important. To use law, our dear father. Yeah, that's not important. They're just gravestones, but none of them are what we're looking for. There are no names on these. Okay. Hmm. Time it is. It's time to consult the walkthrough.
Okay. Come on. Where is the fucking locks room? That's fascinating. Come on. What do we what do we need? Okay. Look close at boiler room window left of the door. Okay. Take the screw holding the clamp of the gutter pipe. Screw. That's it. Screw what screw are you talking about? I do not see any screws. Oh wait a minute. There it is. Yoink. Alright, cool. Got a screw. Alright. Um There we go. Cool, we got rotting scissors now. Now we can use it on the uh, gardening scissors. We can use the gardening scissors on the uh, dried shrub. There we go, that should clear away those. That shrubbery. Awesome. Okay, let's try to push the lid off. Nope. The lid is too heavy. Of course it is. I cannot move it. Alright, we gotta go back to the boiler room. Oh. But I have. Oh, dark corner. Trash, junk, and garbage. A metal rod. I'll take it. There we go. Alright, now we can go open that grave. All right, now we can open this grave finally. Oh no, the grave is empty. Damn it! How do I obtain the fourth key? It's a good question. I can't stop now. I must carry on. Okay. Well, shit. Uh, well, maybe the uh, nurse would know something. back in here. Let's talk to the nurse. May I speak with you? Sure. Tell me, the old graveyard at the back of the sanatorium, has it always been administered by Ashbury? Yes, as far as I know, it has belonged to Ashbury for at least the past hundred years. And before that? Prior to that, it was part of the Wormhill Parish, I believe. Mm. But as I said, that was a very long time ago. Thank you. 
That's enough. So, the old graveyard was administered by the Warmhill Parish. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. That's, That's right. all. Thanks. Okay. Let's see. Walk through. Where are we at? Come on. Let's find a map. There we go. Head over to the Warmhill Vicarage. All right. Enter church. See what he has to say. Father Frederick. Yes? Can I speak with you? Certainly, my son. I am listening. Okay. I need to research one of my ancestors. Can you help me? I would be happy to help you. But... I sense that something is troubling you. Would you like to discuss it? You would relieve your soul. Believe me. You are kind, Father. But I have come for a different reason. I promise. I will return again when I have finished what I must. Very well, then. What do you require from a servant of the Lord? I need to figure out where the remains of Lothar Gordon are preserved. I suspect there might be a record of it in the chronicle of the parish. Hmm. Our chronicles reach far into the past. I believe I should be able to find the information you need. Please, come back later. It's going to take me a while to locate the record. Oh joy, one Thank of these. You, Father. Oh joy, one of these types of things. Okay. Well, let's go to the right click here. And let's head to the castle. Then let's head to the morgue. Okay, I guess we're done with the sanatorium at this point. Because they're not letting us go there anymore. So. And the mine's off limits, apparently. And that place is no longer accessible. Okay, now let's head back over to the Now let's see if we can get an answer from this guy now. Now that we've done all that wandering around, if he's had plenty of time to research with me, the information we need. Surely, I mean, you would think. Let's find out. Father? Okay, you got any information for me? Yes, my son. And I just... Have you found anything in the old chronicles yet, Father? It's very important to me. Not yet. You need to be patient, man. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, God. All right, fine. We'll go back to the castle again. And we'll head back to the morgue again. Then we'll head to the pub again. God, this is stupid. I mean, seriously. And there's no indication when, you know, you'll get the answer. It's just like freaking guesswork. I mean, no indication of when, it, you know, he'll finally tell you what we want to know. I 
mean, it sounds like padding, if you ask me. Okay, please tell me that now he gets a friggin' answer. This is ridiculous. Okay, Father Fred, you got an answer for me now? Father, I need to talk to you. Yes. Have you found anything in the old chronicles yet, Father? It's very important to me. Not yet. Oh, for fuck's you sake. Patient, my son. Oh, God, this is I'll come back stupid. Later. This is so friggin' stupid. Alright, fine, I'll go back to the castle again. I'll go back to the morgue again. Should I actually go in the morgue this time? Okay. Yeah, let's actually go in the morgue this time. And... Go to the pub. I guess actually go in the pub. In. Good afternoon, Harry. More like evening, I'd say. Have you seen the wet? It's an yes. It's very strange. More than that, weather like this brings nothing good. I'm a bit superstitious, you see. Mm -hmm. Yes, I've noticed. But enough about the weather. Here in the pub, we're always comfortable. Will you have anything, Mr. Samuel? I don't think so. I I've just come to ask about things. I thought so. No offense intended, but they're not exactly my best <laughs> The pub is deserted. Where is everyone, Harry? Everyone's probably staying at home. The weather is ghastly today. In fact, I'm not even surprised. Okay, now well, we're down here. Head back to the cemetery. Come on. It's time we got to what we want. I mean, surely at this point, the guy surely has the freaking answer. Okay, please tell me you've got the answer for me now, Frederick. This is getting ridiculous. Father, I need to talk to you. Mm. Yes, go ahead. Have you found anything in the old chronicles yet, Father? It's very important to me. Not yet. What? You need to be patient, my son. Seriously? Mm. I'll come back this later. This is so stupid. I can't believe this crap. Oh, God. Okay, let's go back in here again. Okay. I mean, seriously, this is getting really stupid. At some point, you gotta, like, give me the answer I want so I can continue on. <sighs> Friggin' stupid. Okay. There's that simple. Again. 
I've already looked at that stuff. So that's not important. Can we head back to the pub, I guess? Again. I'm not gonna actually go inside this time, I'm just gonna go around. Seriously, this is getting really stupid. I mean, at some point, are they gonna just, like, give me the answer that I want? One of the crypts of our family. I don't even know who's buried in it. Probably the guy we're looking for. The tomb of Jeremy Gordon. Okay, now that I've looked at these grave sites and shit, uh, are we gonna actually, like, get... Does Frederick have a fucking answer for me now? Seriously, this is getting really frustrating. Oh, seriously, give it a freaking answer. This is stupid. Please tell me I have the fucking answer this time. I'm getting real disgusted. Father, I need to talk to you. Yes, go ahead. You have returned just in time. Finally! I found the record you need in the Jeez. Lothar Gordon was the father of Thomas Gordon, who was the father of William. His remains were buried near Ashbury, as per his last wishes. In Ashbury? After some time, however, his body was cremated and transferred into one of your family tombs in the graveyard of the vicarage. That is where it is resting now. Thanks, Father. You have been in great help. Yeah, after you finally Only gave me the answer. Me, I am happy to have a look at the Chronicles. Yeah, thanks for finally giving me the answer. Sir, jeez. Took forever. Anyway. Now let's head to the... We gotta lead to the rear cemetery here. Wow, if Samuel could just move a lot faster, that would be perfect, you know? But unfortunately, no. It was really like snail's pace. Oh. Looks like one of the tombs is open. One of the crypts is open there. Who opened the crypt? Yeah, that's a good question. Oh, the grave digger. Is anyone there? Who's there this late at night? Is it you? What are you doing here? Okay. I know this is not exactly the right hour to take a walk around the graves, but I have my reasons. Yeah, you've probably got some real good reasons. I'm looking for Lothar Gordon's remains, and this is the last possible place. I would like to have a look inside. It won't take long. No, I won't let you in at this time. I've got my work to finish. Come by tomorrow and you can spend however long you want inside. I have to finish my work, so I'll be going back to it. Hold on. We can certainly find a way to settle this. I'm listening. 
You can go down and see if you can find the urn for me. It's very important, and you won't lose out on it. Let me get this straight. You come to a cemetery after midnight to dig up an urn in the tomb of some ancestor of yours, and you will pay me to help you find it? Exactly. It's got to be very important indeed, as far as I can tell. To hell with it. I'll go and find it for free. Awesome. So, whose urn is it that you want? Lothar Gordon's. It must be somewhere in the crypt. Okay. Wait here. It's going to take me a while to find it. Sure. Can't take any longer than Father Frederick did to get me that answer I wanted. Lock You're quicker. right. I found it. Here you are. Cool. Now I've got to get back to work. You've cost me a lot of time already. I would still like to go to bed today. Ah, bed. I'll leave you to your work. Good. The sooner I get to my bed, the better. Right. All right. Let's. Let's look at the urn. Where is it? Ah, there it is. Cool. Another key. Awesome. Just one more key left. Williams. There's only one way to obtain it. I fear the thought, but I have no choice. I must finish what I have begun. God forgive me. Okay. Let's check the toolbox. A flashlight might come in handy in this darkness. Yep. Now all we just gotta do is get William's key. All right, let's check out. The ground hasn't hardened yet. What is it I am saying? I don't know. All right, let's. Uh... Ah, here we go. It's too dark. I can't see anything in there. Well, that's how we got a flashlight. It's shining. The batteries are okay. There we go. A shovel is lying on the heap. Cool. We'll take that. All right. It's too dark. I can't see anything in there. Hmm. Can we use flashlight? Any important, I guess. Isabella Santi died in 1932. I guess we have that. I guess that's not important. Right. We're nearing the end, so I'm going to. I'm going to get the last two keys today, and then I'm going to end this. So, let's see. we got to get the... Uh... I've got 
to get rid of the grave digger first. Okay. Ah, I'll take that. Peg is holding the door open. I will take that. Take the wire. It's holding the metal door open. Well, let's untie it then. Ha! He won't be getting out easily. Yeah, he's not going to be too happy with you. Cool, get the last key. Forgive me, William. I had to do it. Last key. The last one. All right. Okay. Well, that's all we're gonna do for today. We got all the keys. Actually, you know what? I want to end uh, chapter five. So let's. Uh, Front of the church here. Huh. The hell? Hmm. Our carriage. Somebody must have come to the vicarage. Victoria? Hmm. I'll have a look in the church. That was Bates. What is he doing here? Mm. Why did he go to the confessional in such a hurry? Yeah. We must find out somehow. Someone is coming. Most likely Father Frederick. I heard footsteps a minute ago. Did someone come in before you? I didn't see anyone. You must have heard me. Hmm. Perhaps you are right. Is there some way I can help you? No, Father. Thank you. In that case, I will depart. Uh huh. Okay, here we go. Uh oh. I know who has caused all this evil. I know who killed people. Here it comes. People. I can no longer bear keeping this secret to myself, so I must confess. I saw him sneaking through the night, covered by the darkness. His palms, they were stained with blood. Samuel. Quickly, so that he would not see me. When I briefly looked into his face, I was stunned with awe. I still have his expression before my eyes. All this time, I remained silent. I could not tell anyone. They would not believe me anyway. Samuel. Even I would not believe it if I had not seen his face with my own eyes. I am afraid of pronouncing his name, Father. Do go on, son. I know the devil has many faces. 
that night I saw one of them. The face was that of the Lord of Castle Black Mirror, the youngest of the family, Samuel Gordon. <gasps> oh shit. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's all coming together. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Uh. Whoa. Oh, see, he was possessed. I was right. Chapter 6. Forgive me, my lord, for my sins, and give me strength to carry on. Give me strength to stand up to evil and destroy the curse that has harassed my family for so long. Give me strength, my lord. Amen. There's only one way from the quiet areas of the church. I must descend into the depths of the catacombs and destroy the source of evil that has taken over my soul. I was right. He was possessed. Okay, but we will have to do that next time. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Say it again. Here. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more Black Bear One. Stay tuned for each other's Let's Plays. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Stay tuned for future Let's Plays. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comments, and I will see you next time. But for now, bye bye.